Good afternoon everybody, it's a little, just a one Blu-ray update, very very quickly, I've just been to the big Astor at Eastlands near Man City's ground uh, to get me a supply for the next month, so while I was there I had a quick look at the Blu-rays, they're quite expensive a lot of Astor stuff but they had a box section there where the, everything was a fiver and I've picked up one Blu-ray for five quid which I'm very happy with. It's a classic of the late 60s stars. Henry Fonda, Jason Robards, Woody Strode and Charles Bronson. And it's directed by the Italian master himself, Sergio Leone. It's also got a script from Dario Argento before he made it big with all the giallo horror stuff. And the film I'm talking about is the classic Once Upon a Time in the west sorry if it's back to front it's just i'm doing this on my tablet now it also stars henry fonda in what he's basically is the only role he's ever played where he's been evil or really a real pardon the french bad bastard now this is the remastered version on blu-ray it's great it's only a fiver it's been put down to a 12 certificate, but when it first came out, it was the old X certificate, meaning 18. Now, uh, it's basically a revenge story. Charles Bronson plays a character called Harmonica. That's his nickname because he always plays a harmonica. Now, when he was away working, uh, Henry Fonda and his gang turn up at his property and basically massacre his family and his brother. So, Henry Fo uh, so Charles Bronson goes on this journey to try and seek revenge for the death of his wife, children and his family and his brother. And it's an absolute bona fide classic. can recommend it 100%. It's 165 minutes long, which is a lot, a lot, a long time for a film. But once you get into it, it's amazing. There's some great slow-mo slow -mo shots and everything, as in you see the scenery the whole of the Spanish desert where it was filmed and everything. And Henry Fonda, is no, it's called Frank, but he's actually known as Blue Eyes because he's got piercing blue eyes. And most killers in films, as you know, are not blue-eyed. They're always dark brown eyes, but he's got the most piercing, beautiful blue eyes. But you wouldn't trust him with anything. So if you've never seen it and you like good old westerns, it's in the vein of the good, bad and ugly few dollars more than a fistful of dollars the, which is known as the fistful of dollars trilogy with clint eastwood it's a cracking film i recommend it to anyone and then for the five i'm not complaining as the well done for that one so i hope you like the little video and i'll chat cheers all soon bye